I'm Professor David Dunaway. I'm a plastic and reconstructive surgeon and I'm a member of the craniofacial team here at Great Ormond Street Hospital. I started my career as a plastic surgeon in 1997 where I was a consultant at uh, the Canisburn Plastic Surgery Unit in Glasgow. And in 2000, I was invited to come to Great Ormond Street to form part of the craniofacial team here. And since 2004, I've uh, been clinical lead for that team and I've, I hope helped to make great developments within the craniofacial team. My particular interest is in children that have problems both with facial development and cranial development. And most of these children have craniosynostosis. The operation that I'm perhaps best known for is frontofacial distraction, which is an operation that gradually allows us to uh, uh, improve the form of face, the faces of children with craniosynostosis, and treats the functional and appearance problems that they have. I've also been involved during my time here with the separation of two craniopagus twins. Those are twins that are joined at the head. And I'm happy to say that uh, with my colleague, Mr. Oase Jelani, we've managed to separate these twins very successfully without any neurological uh, damage at all. And that, I think, is a key element for us. I also have an interest in research, and I'm Professor of Craniofacial Surgery at the Institute of Child Health at University College London, where my particular interests relate to measuring outcomes in craniofacial surgery, three-dimensional imaging and analysis of the face and developing new devices that allow us to do craniofacial surgery in a more simple and straightforward way. Many of the children that we treat from at Great Ormond Street Hospital come from outside the UK and there are many patients from the Gulf area. And I think we've treated uh, approximately 200 children with craniofacial conditions in the uh, craniofacial unit here. I also have an interest in voluntary work and another of my interests is in a condition called NOMA which affects people in sub-Saharan Africa who don't have access to medicine or good diet and causes severe facial deformity. And I regularly go to Ethiopia with a team of surgeons and nurses who, many of whom come from Great Ormond Street to treat these children there. Overall, I've, I really enjoy working in the craniofacial unit here at Great Ormond Street, which is a vibrant department which I think is leading the way in many of the techniques and treatments needed to treat children with this, these very challenging conditions. Music